welcome to this video. This video explains how we could use ALE or Arbitrary Lagrangian Eulerian Remeshing method to prevent mesh distortion in Abacus software. In bulk metal forming, after severe deformation, the mesh will be distorted, and to prevent mesh distortion, the ALE method can be used. In this method, the number of elements and number of nodes are kept to be constant and by changing the location of the nodes, the mesh will be improved. Remeshing procedure is performed at regular increments and for each remeshing, several remeshing sweeps are performed. In our previous video, we have performed the simulation of upsetting in a cylinder and as you can see, the elements are distorted dramatically. This result cannot be accepted due to the severe mesh distortion. Now we can go to the step module and add remeshing rule to this simulation by ALE adaptive mesh control and defining the remeshing method. We can choose between volumetric Laplacian and equipotential methods of remeshing or we can Enter weight of these methods and have a combination of these methods in our simulation. After setting the remeshing method, we use the remeshing rule for a specific domain. Here we should at first pick the domain that remeshing will be happen on it. Please notice that picking the only necessary domain will reduce our computational cost. After that, we choose the remeshing control method that we have defined. And after that, we have frequency. This option means after how many increments remeshing is performed. And after that, we enter the number of sweep per remeshing. Every time that remeshing is performed, several attempts are done for remeshing and we enter the number of these attempts. For example, the current setting means that every 10 increments a remeshing is performed and for each remeshing, 5 attempts are done to improve the mesh quality. Now we can run the problem another time and see the change in the results. By plotting the deformed part another time, we can see that mesh distortion is significantly controlled comparing to our previous simulation. By the ALE method, we can increase our accuracy and also decrease the chance of the termination of the job. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If this video has helped you out, please let us know by a like, a comment or a subscribe. See you in next videos.